What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, it's your boy Artie and in today's video we're going to be doing our first oil change on the 2022 Kia K5. guys let's start off this video with the parts that I'm gonna be using and this right here is personal preference but I'm gonna be going with the full synthetic 0W20 so 0W20 is what you need but mobile one like I said is personal preference so this is one quart I couldn't find a five quart jug at the store next to me so I had to buy five of these so we're gonna be using just under five quarts but we're gonna be checking our oil at the end with the dipstick now when we're talking about the oil filter I went the OEM way I like the OEM way so this is a Kia genuine filter all of the parts that i'll be using i'll link in the description i'll also pop up up on the screen and if you have any questions during the process make sure you comment down below and ask me and i'll be uh, replying to all the comments so let's just put the car up on the jacks i have well, actually i drove it up on the ramp i actually had the car warm up for a few minutes and then let's get underneath the car and start the oil change all right so once you're under the car if you're coming in from the front end you're going to have this cover right here that has two clips that you're going to need to remove with a small screwdriver or a clip remover. So this is for you to access your oil filter and then if you continue going back right there you're going to see a bigger cover. So this right here is for your drain plug. Now this has two 10 millimeter sockets that you're going to need to unscrew and you also have clips right here. So let's continue back and focus on the oil filter right here. Remove the cover and then remove the filter. All right, so to remove the oil filter, once we remove the underneath cover, right here you're gonna need a 24 millimeter socket. And right there you're gonna have to remove that pin to drain all of the oil from the filter. But to remove that pin, all you need to do is basically twist it opposite way with pliers. But you also need to pull this little security plug out right there for this to come out and to drain the oil. So let's attack this and then we'll take out the filter. All right, so we're under the car, we're gonna drain the oil right now and continue on with this oil change. So put a towel over there, size 17 socket. Let's do this. All right, so the oil stopped dripping. We put the new, this is very important, the new washer over here, and we're gonna start putting it back together and uh, put the filter back in. All right, so we got the filter out right here. As you guys can see, this car, bad, bad, dirty filter. So this is interesting. When you pull this out, before you pull this out to drain and bleed the oil, you have to take this out of the side. So let's see what's in the box, what's included. So right here, you have a new one of these. You have your O-ring, your filter, and this portion right here. So this is interesting. It twists and then it pulls out and then the same way it goes like this. You're gonna insert this. Uh, we're going to clean this up right now, put the new filter and put everything back into place. So we're going to put some more oil over here around the o-ring. I started doing this and I forgot that I'm not recording. So we're gonna get this all lubricated with old oil that's left over and we're gonna start putting everything back together. All right guys, so final step, we're gonna be pouring our new oil and this baby's supposed to run like beauty. So we're gonna use the funnel 
And like I said, I'm using Mobile One, my favorite, a Zero W20 full synthetic. So this is, like I said, one quart. We need just under five quarts, like 4.9 quarts. So we're gonna pour as needed. And then we got the traditional dipstick. So we're gonna be checking the dipstick to check our levels. Once we get this off of the ramp and we're good to go guys. So if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. Uh, check out for other DIY videos and Kia updates. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.